This tutorial will show how you can import data in Pioneer v6. If you want to import data in Pioneer v, you should first export a template of data, which is a file uh, you can export from Pioneer v that gives you a structure of file you'd like to import, edit, add record in this file, and import file. So let's start by uh, exporting a template of data. First go to the, the object you'd like to import, like sales orders. Uh, I have two sales orders here, one which has one line, and the other one which has two lines. And I will export this data by selecting the export data tool in my menu. I have to select the ID or the database ID, so I put this field so that OpenRP will if you modify a, new, a record or create a record. If you don't export the ID of the of each record, OpenRP will consider everything the creation of a new record. Then I will put the customer. I can go to use the customer name, the customer database ID, the linker, or the XML ID or the ID of your external uh, software to read links. So let's take the name of the customer. And then I will take the other lines. For each of the lines, I will have the uh, database ID. And then the description of the line, and then the quantity of each order lines, the price, and the unit of measure, like this. I can save the export by OK. You see that I export something which is more compatible. I save, like sales.cv, like this. And now I can import this uh, the own office of Microsoft Excel. So I will take my file, sales.csv. Here is my, my file, and I can uh, change anything like So, for instance, I can change my partner here. It's not Cilium, but uh, let's say Alor. And I can change the, the label here, which is new label, and a quantity of two. I can create a new line, which is a new line, with a quantity of two, a unit price of 100. I save. And now I can import back my data by clicking that here. I select my file, which is sales.csv. I click on auto detect so that OpenERP takes all uh, the fields which are in my file. And then I click on OK. And OpenERP import all data. If I reload, you see that I have here a uh, new line, which is two pieces of 100. And OpenERP change uh, the volume by high seller in the seller dose, which is here. So it's perfectly worth. Uh, you can modify. modify this uh, cell order or add some lines like here. You can export any kind of data like this. So if you want to import some customers, just go to the customers tab. Uh, let's take a few customers like this. Export. Uh, you select uh, the structure, like let's take the database ID, the name of my customer, and then my customer have different contacts. So we take uh, address uh, where are my contacts here. And for each contact, I will export the database ID and the name of the contact. Where is it? contact name and uh, I can select also the uh, category of partners. Where is it? Categories, which is a many to many, each partner can be several categories. I save this, like partners.csv, save. And now I can import, open this in uh, open office of Microsoft Excel. Let's take partners.csv, like this. And here is my data, I have three partners, these three. And aggregate has several contacts. One is Paul Lelitre, Sylvie Lelitre, Sylvie Lelitre. I can a new partner, new partner, with a new contact, new contact, and I can say it's a square. I can change also aggregate and rename this by aggregate new name. You save. And then you can import back by clicking import data, select my partner field, file, sorry, auto detect, and click OK. And OpenRP has imported my data. If I load, I, I have new, I have a new part, I have modified the name of my partner there, which is a new name, and I should have a new partner. Where is it? Which is partner here, and my new partner have a new contact. Here. 